We're going to welcome in our next guest now, Diana Mursky from Coaches Sports Bar and Grill is here to talk about the second annual speed dating event. We talked with you last year. Yes. We want to know, any serious love connections come out of last year? There was not. Okay. Oh. We're hoping We're for hoping. this year then. This, this year. might be the year. This might be the year. <laughs> but it was a success last year. It was a great success. Everybody had a really good time. Um, we had friends come out of it, so yeah. it was good. How, how many people did you have participating last year? We had 24 last year. Wow. Okay. Yeah, so it was a nice turnout. We broke yep. everybody. Um, we actually had two separate groups because we had a younger group and then we had an older group. Oh. Okay. Um, so this year it's looking like we have one big group. Okay. Um, with the age range, and we have 18 people signed up. Okay, right there's now. still time for more. There's there still time is. to sign up for speed dating. Yes. Monday the 12th is the last day to sign up. Okay. okay. So how much time do you get with with other folks there? We have it um, broken into eight minutes. Okay. And then you get a little warning one minute prior to having to switch tables, and we have the guys moving one way and the girls moving another. Okay. And we is have that, is that is eight minutes typical? Because I'm sitting here thinking, boy, if this is awkward, eight minutes could be a long time. I know, but if you're <laughs> making, but it's, it, I think yeah. it's a good amount of time to make a connection yes. or yeah. to get a little bit deeper. And our hosts are there, so they'll pay attention to cues if something is awkward to they'll come around. over and break it up so, okay oh, yeah we nice. keep it moving nice that's funny yeah. when you come to something like this do you have to be prepared with your own questions or are there t like how does this work we, when you do it we actually have um, a double-sided card that sits in the middle of the table and it has different questions on each side that is such a good and idea. every table is different and there's a few serious questions and then there's some really silly ones okay um, that's like, would great. you rather swim in a pool of syrup or mashed potatoes? Like just to break up the yeah, yeah. the awkwardness. You guys yeah. have thought of everything over yeah. there at Coaches. And the greatest part is with your ticket to come to the speed dating, you also get an app and a beverage. So for what, like 20 bucks? Yes. I mean, and you can find the love of your life. What else would you want to do on Valentine's Day? I you know? know? <laughs> I think that it's a great oh, idea. Goodness. Where did this idea come from? Um, we are not very busy on Valentine's Day. I feel like a lot of couples like going to a little nicer of a restaurant and a corner bar isn't, or a sports bar isn't really the place sure. to go. It's not a first thought. It's not. Yeah. So we were like, what could we do? And it's like, let's hone in on the singles. And then I don't know, just I guess from the movies. Love yeah, it. Just put it together. Yeah. I think it's a great idea. <laughs> I do too. And you're going to have to come back and tell us if there's a love connection made at this speed dating event. Uh, but you said people can still sign up through Monday. How do they do that? They just need to stop into the bar. We ask for payment at the time of sign up okay. and that's it. And how much is it to, to speed date? $20. Just 20 bucks. bucks to find the love of your life? That's right. Priceless, it. really. I love this. Again, this is happening on Valentine's Day. So don't sit at home alone no. looking for that connection. And the worst thing, you, you get a good meal and, and a drink and perhaps meet a friend. Right. And, and some good laughs, too. Diana, thanks for yeah. stopping in. Yeah. Thank you. Good luck. We're going to send this.